Hello everyone, I'm the T. Hello the T. Introduce yourselves. <laughs> I am Holly. I'm Finn. Uh, I'm Avery. And today we're gonna play Legendary, a Marvel deck building game. It's uh it's one of my favorite board games actually, so we're gonna have some fun here. I have never played this one, so I'm excited. Yes. So it's um there are a lot of games that are called the deck building games that it's like a whole genre that doesn't that not one company owns, which is kind of interesting actually that multiple companies could just make a game that works exactly the same way. But each one has their own little spin on it, and I think Legendary does some interesting stuff with it. But first, let's go ahead and read about what the game is about. I actually hit the show viewer button here because that'll make this easier. Boop. All right, welcome to Legendary, the Marvel deck building game. Evil masterminds like Magneto and Doctor Doom, or Red Skull, we're going to fighting Red Skull today, uh, lead a cool. horde of powerful supervillains, planning dark schemes to destroy the Marvel Universe. Only you can stop them, leaving, leading awesome Marvel superheroes like Spider-Man, Iron Man, and Wolverine. In this game for 1-5 to five players, each player starts with their own deck of basic hero cards. At the start of your turn, you play the top card of the villain deck, showing how villains invade the city, capture bystanders, and create special events. Then you play hero cards from your hand to generate attack, recruit points, and special abilities. You attack with your heroes to defeat villains. You use recruit points to recruit better heroes to add to your deck. Whenever your deck runs out of cards, you shuffle your discard pile to make a new deck, including all the new heroes you recruited. This way, your deck gets stronger and stronger over time. Build up enough power, and you can defeat the Mastermind. But be careful. If the players don't defeat the, the evil Mastermind quick enough, then the Mastermind will complete their dark scheme and win the game for evil. So basically, uh, yeah, how to win. Players must work together to successfully attack the evil mastermind four times. If they do, then the mastermind is beaten once and for all, and all the players win. The game... But the forces... Of, I don't like the way that sentence came out. Then the mastermind is beaten once for all, and the players win the game for the forces of good. In addition, defeating villains and rescuing bystanders earns each player victory points. If the players defeat the mastermind, then the player with the most victory points is the most legendary hero of all, and the individual winner. So... Primarily, we want to defeat the evil mastermind, but we also want also to be the best one who did it. Yes. So, okay. See, because unlike other games in Legendary, the game itself fights back against the players. The evil mastermind isn't played by a player. Instead, the game itself plays a part of the mastermind. The evil mastermind works to accomplish an evil scheme throughout the game. Every scheme card has a part that says evil wins, which tells you how the mastermind completes their scheme. If the evil scheme is completed, then the mastermind wins the game for evil and all the players lose. Yeah. All right. And start off with, the, um, we're playing the, what's called the first game setup, which is like a selection of cards that it tells you to do for your first game. That includes fighting Red Skull as the mastermind here. He's cool. extremely weak. <laughs> um, the scheme is he's going to unleash the power of the Cosmic Cube, which is like kind of referenced to one of the early Red Skull, well, not early Red Skull stories, but one of the early Silver Age stories. Um, if anyone's seen, like, any Marvel Cinematic Universe stuff, the Cosmic Cube is the Tesseract. So, yeah. Right. And, eh, I don't need to explain all this. So all these cards go in the villain deck together. Shuffle them up. And then the heroes we have, we have Spider-Man, Iron Man, Wolverine, Cyclops, and Hawkeye. Oh, Hawkeye. And those, all those cards go in the hero deck, too. Or here, they go in their own hero deck. So shuffle those up. And, cool. yep, and then we put five cards in the HQ, which are the cards we can recruit uh, initially. Oh, I Spider -Man, see. Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Oh, I was hoping it'd all be Spider-Man. Yeah. So the thing is, um, <laughs> it's something, that's, something that's not super clear is, like, the cards are different, even if they're the same art. Um, because in the first set, like, all the Spider-Man cards have one picture, all the Hawkeye cards have one picture. They fix that for later expansions, so it's just, but it can be a little bit confusing. But, but yeah. I think th these two cards are the same, though. But just because of the same color. Is, that a, hmm? is the Astonishing one have different stats than the other one? Yes. Um, okay. They do They do have different texts on them. Yep. Oh, okay. It, yep. it looks like it does a different thing and maybe is worth one victory point? I got. I got no. to zoom in. Oh, okay. No. It was a guess. Yeah, the star <laughs> is uh, the recruit point that it, recruit points that it give you. So I'll just go ahead and do the first turn because the book says choose a player to go first. So I'm, I'm going to choose me. Sure. Um, so first thing actually everyone, to, everyone needs to do is they have a little deck of 12 cards in front of you. Go ahead and shuffle that deck. 
and oh god, it's it's six cards, right? I always forget in these. I games. have twelve. Yeah, oh, no, no. How many, how many draw? Over. Yeah, how many draw at first? Um, let's, let's double check. Boop boop boop. Uh, boop 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 boop. Come on, load. Oh, I think I passed it. <laughs> I imagine it'd be near the start. Uh, five cards. Uh, oh, no, that's, no, that's not that's it. That's for the HQ. It's six. Yep, it's six. You're, you're good. It is six. six. Uh, I can read that. Yep, there it is. It draws a hand of six cards. Everyone draw six cards. Okay. You can just type six on your thing. Well, well. Or drag them all in. Three. Whichever is easiest. One, two, three, four, five. I get to click the draw button six times. That's the way to do it. That works. So at the start of your turn, the first thing you will do is reveal the top card of the villain deck. If it's a villain, it enters the city. It's a sentinel. I should have done this differently because all my cards are face down. Why is it not wanting to? There it goes. Oh, there we go. Okay. I, I fixed it. I fixed it. There we go. There we go. So the sentinel is a henchman villain. Um, in each in the villain deck, there are ten identical sentinel sentinel cards. They all are three attacks, so they're very easy to beat. Um, so henchman villains are usually not an issue, even though this is a giant robot. Still, just three attack. And um, on your turn, you basically just play all the cards from your hand. Sometimes it, the order that you play them in matters, most of the time it doesn't. And even if you don't choose to play a card, it, you still discard it at the end of the turn. So it's kind of, yeah, play it or, play it or don't. So I'm, I have four cards of Recruit, which are the stars. The star icon is Recruit, which lets me recruit heroes. And two attack, which is not going to be enough to fight Sentinel, so I can't cannot fight it. Got it. Okay. So now I, all right. Okay. Knowing the symbols, I'm like, oh, okay. Now I see what we're doing. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I guess it's worth mentioning. There are two types of currency, and they do different things. Got um, it. Got it. Spider Man is really good, and I don't want to like steal him from other like if, since if I just went really hard on Spi on Spider Man, I would win very quickly. So I might just grab this Hawkeye instead. I mean, it's a cooperative game. Yeah, but I also don't. I also don't want to win too hard. Oh, also another thing we have to do is we have to. Shuffle these tactic cards under the Red School. There. Okay. Oh, another thing, to, another option is if you don't want to buy any of the cards here, there's also these Shield Officer cards you can buy for three. Um, oh, yeah, I should mention the cost is in the bottom right. <laughs> That's how much recruit you have to pay to buy it. So if you want to buy a Shield Officer instead of one of these cards, you can. Are there multiple different cards in that deck? Nope, there are 30 it's identical all... Shield Officers. Okay, that's a, I wasn't sure if they're all the same card. Okay, yep, that's why. It. Yep. So, so you would buy this if you wanted more recruit points that had too much gold. Yeah, if you have, yeah, if okay. you didn't have enough, um, if you didn't, if there there wasn't anything you wanted to buy, and you desperately need more recruiting ability. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'll grab Hawkeye. That uses up all four of my recruit, and I fill that back in, and gather all these together, put them in my discard pile, and that is my turn. So now we go clockwise so <laughs> holly is next nice. all right and also these counters are here just like i made them just to be easier if you need to use them like if things are complicated but they usually don't get they yeah eventually they will get complicated but for now it's not super important okay yep do, do i draw a card on my turn or so the first thing you do is um draw the top card of the villain deck okay yep and flip it over oh no no i'll put that over there Yes. So instead of a villain, this is a master strike. What a master okay, strike! I'm glad, it, I'm glad it got complicated right away. Yes. Um. So the, I mean, the master strike is simple. It's just on the mastermind master, master, mastermind card over here. It says what the master strike does. Each player KOs a hero from their hand. So look at your hand and choose a hero you don't want and KO it. Get rid of it. All uh, cards oh. are heroes. Is that what's going on? Ye um. Basically. Oh, no, it says hero. I yeah. See. It says hero well, on there. Geez. Okay. Okay. All card, all the oh, cards okay. you recruit from the hero deck are heroes. And where is the right. discard pile? Uh, KOs go up here. Is and... it in the big KO box? Yes. Oh, um... so KO actually removes it from your deck. Yes. Okay. So that can be a good thing because you're getting rid of... Yes. Yes, because you want to, uh, I guess, maximize your deck's efficiency. Yes. Yep. And, oop. and the Master Strike also goes <laughs> in the KO pile. But the gears are turning now. I'm like, oh, it's one of these. Okay, good. <laughs> That's what a deck builder is, but yeah. Yeah, all right. I'm in. Yeah. All right. All right do, do we still get a new villain, or is it just the Master Strike was the Mastermind's turn? Nope, that was it. And now it's... Yep. Okay. One card from the villain deck, yep. So now if I want to 
yeah. buy or recruit something, I could like. Yeah, so just yeah, lay out your cards so we can see what you have, and yeah. I have three more of these guys. We have recruit, and I guess two of attack. I'm guessing. <laughs> and I would like to uh, buy Iron Man. Yep, just put them into your discard pile, which is right next to your deck. Okay. There you go. These, that is weird that it's making them face down when you drag them. Hmm. I might, that might be something I need to look at. Was it? Um, it on my end. Was. Yeah. Oh, okay. Weird. I don't know if that's and something... Then... Okay, go ahead. Oh, and then, and then and you then... immediately replace the hero deck, but I'll go pick out that. Okay. Yep. So then if I were to do an attack, it would need to be at least three, otherwise it'd be useless, right? Yes, yep. Okay. But you so still I'm discard gonna... those cards. Yeah, I'll still discard the rest of my hand. Yep. And then you draw six cards. And I will draw these six cards. And then the next person can go? Yep. All right. I think I get it. That's Avery. Okay. So then can I just bring all my cards over there with me? You can. Also, first draw a card from the villain deck. Or reveal oh, a yes, card yes, from yes, the villain yes, deck. Yes, yes, yes. Yep. Nope. So I think I do. Yeah, I think you do is grab it and then just flip it over so we can see what it is first. F. Nope, that's, that's the whole deck. Hug. It's okay. I had it. There we go. There we go. That's the same card. <laughs> all right. So the so if the villain it pushes forward all villains forward. Okay. Yes. Oh, I like the escalation there of eventually being like yes. on the Golden Gate Bridge. That's how yep. bad things have gotten. Yes. That's and, cool. And if a villain escapes, uh, something minorly bad happens. But so you don't, we don't want to let him escape. Uh, so he's there, and if you fight him, you can gain an officer. Okay, I got yes. it. Now. I want to bring all my cards over there. Yep. Can I? Um, the easiest way to do that is to click on them Should all I... and press like hold control and click on them, and then you can drag them all together. There's no way to draw just... a box around them though. Yeah, we can just do that. I can just... Don't stack them together though. Be nice to me. There it goes. Yeah. And usually, I just put them like separate. Which ones are recruit? And which ones are attack? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna use all these for recruit, and then. Yeah, that doesn't help you. Yeah. Uh, what can I get for four? A Spider Man. Okay. Yeah. Let's grab the Spider Man. Uh, also, you don't have to rotate them. They will automatically... Uh, the, the, the snap points will... I was more excited that I realized I could rotate with the <laughs> mouse wheel. Yes. And then, so, I don't... There's nothing I can attack that's useful, but using it will discard it. Um, either way, you have to discard it, so... Yeah. Okay, either way. That's, I was curious if you could keep stuff around, but yeah, yes. that makes sense. Also, you have you still have two more recruits, so you could get another Spider-Man if you want. Two Spider-Mans? Yeah. They're pointing at each other. It's great. I did... <laughs> All right. I'm done with my turn. Alrighty. All right. I need to do some maintenance on these cards here. If you, if you yeah, you should be if you if you grab drop do a box around them and then drop them right on the discard pile, then it should go. Yeah. Wow. And I'm gonna draw more cards. Yep. Draw six cards. All right. So that's what we got. Ah, uh, the super scroll. Scrolls are cool. I like them. Scrolls are basically the um. The shapeshifters of the Marvel Universe, that's what they do, is they shapeshift. Right. And they also were enemies of the Fantastic Four. Um, so the Super Scroll is one that has all of the abilities of the Fantastic Four. All right. Well, so if, any, if anyone fights, we all have to KO a... Yep. That's scary. All right. I mean, it's, I mean, it's usually it's it also depends be what good. You have. It's usually you. good. Exactly, yes. I guess. Yep. And this number here, the, the scar here, that's what we have to get to yep. uh, attack them? Okay. Yes, yep. Great. All right, so I got three of those, and Thank then you. two of these. So I will start by attacking the Hydra Kidnappers. All righty. So Gives... you just try to take him. Rotate and there's, there's, like... a, there's a victory pile thing right here that you can put it in. Oh, sorry, where was that? Uh, over right, right by your hand. Oh, OK. Yep. Oh, there, oh there's, yep, there you go. And you feel like you, yep, it'll right. drop it right in there. OK. And since he's worth one victory point, and you also may gain a shield officer. You don't have to, but you can. Seems like a good idea, right? Sure, yeah. And then that'll be in the discard pile, or straight to the hand? Yep, straight to the discard pile, yep. Oh, so you couldn't do that to, like, ramp into your turn and buy something cooler? No. Alright, and then I'll take a Spider-Man. <laughs> Alrighty. That's it. And then these are all coming back to me. Yep, and they all go to your discard pile. Yeah, you can right, just I'll... as long yeah, yeah, you don't have to worry about rotating them. Just like just yeah, as long as your cursor's there. Yep, there you go. Perfect. Okay. 
Alrighty, my so turn. One day I'll learn this game. No right, the bank is safe. Bystander. Now. So when you uh, when a bystander appears, the first available villain captures it. So. Oh. Yes. So it goes there, and Super Scroll captures it. Yep, and it is worth an extra victory point when you fight Super Scroll. And if if Super Scroll or if a villain escapes with a bystander, that's even worse than if a villain escapes on its own. Naturally. Noted. Yes. All right. So let's oh, see. Was I supposed to draw back up to six? Oh yes. Yep. Draw. Draw. Got right. six. Yep. Yeah. yeah, you can just type six on it. That works too. Yep. All right. So I have four recruit and one attack. So I'm not fighting anything. Um. I guess I can grab another Hawkeye so I can get more attack. And that is so all when I you, do. When yeah. you set up the starter game, are there like other cards that aren't necessarily going to show up each time? You said yes. like yep. There are there are more heroes than just these five. And, and you kind of have to pick five for each game you play. It's not like you're going to do like a game with like every single card, right? Yep, correct. Um, every okay. game you do five heroes, or if you're playing with five players, it's it's actually six heroes. But yeah. Okay. Okay. Yes. Is there any reason to want to have the same hero a bunch? Um, so it's usually they work together. So Spider-Man's thing is that um, he worked really well with cards that cost two or less. So all of his cards cost two. Okay. Yes. So, I mean, for example, like my Hawkeye one that I've been um, buying works better when it has Avenger cards. Um, so as long as they have cards that are have the Avengers team, which are in this one Hawkeye and Iron Man, then those work together well. Okay, so they're like different archetypes of deck. Yes, sort of, yeah. Okay. Yep. All right, Holly's turn. All right. Let's take a look at the villain deck. That looks like a villain. So... Yep, hand ninjas. Yep, so move this one forward. Yeah. Yep. When if you if you fight the hand ninjas, you get a recruit point. Yep. Yes. Which, so head, uh, headman I... villains are very easy and uh, simple, yeah. and usually their fight effect kind of helps you or. Yeah. Yeah. So I will not be fighting anything this turn, unfortunately. No worries. Uh, I do have four. I might as well just buy Spider-Man as Lyclops, I guess. You know, so if you want to, you can buy one thing and then draw another card from the hero deck and see what comes out first before you decide what the second thing That's, you buy. That is true. That is true. Yes. So. All right. I feel like I'm not in the the. Spider-Man archetype, so I'll buy a yeah. Cyclops. Alrighty. I, I don't want to be fighting with you for the cards. Mm, well, maybe. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I'll buy a Spider-Man. Yeah. Uh. I mean, you don't. You also choose not to buy anything. Yeah. You just don't want to. Yeah. 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 I'm just thinking, like, do I plan to buy a lot of expensive things? Yes. Maybe later, and I might get chances to KO Spider-Man if I feel like I have too many things to cost too much. So I might already? as well now. Yeah. Yeah. The Spider. The uh, okay. the Iron Man you have is three. Is three costs. So. Yes. Yeah, but, that's true, yeah. So you're still going to go for that? Yeah. Yeah, I'll still do it. Alrighty. And then I will replace the hero card. Yep. Oh, that's cool. And then everything goes on my graveyard, or my discard pile. I, am I oh, okay, oh well, I got you, the... Oh, good. God. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, 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 Where is it? Uh, uh, uh. There it is. Okay. <laughs> okay. Good enough. Everything yeah. goes in here. And then I shuffle up and draw. Yep. Is that uh, the idea? Yeah, flip, flip. Yeah, pick, pick it up. Yeah. Flip it over. I'm just trying to go. pick up the whole thing. There you just go. gotta carve those markers into the table so you don't have that problem. Yeah, the problem <laughs> is if you, if you lock them, then you can't change them. All right. Mm. So I will end my turn. All righty. All right. Give me that villain deck. I'm gonna do this correctly this time. What? What? Scheme twist. Scheme twist. So now the scheme uh -oh. activates. Oh, that doesn't twist. sound good. Put this twist next to the scheme. That's what it does. <laughs> All right. Oh, you need like eight twists to happen before. Oh no, things happen at five and six. Okay, I see. Yep. So that, that's I why see, this, this, this scheme is easy, one of the easier ones because nothing happens until five okay. of the twists have come out. I see. I see. Okay, let me draw uh, Oops, early. So, so we lose if there's eight twists. Yep. And... Once eight twists come out, we lose. Yeah. And starting at five twists, it's going to become harder for us each time. Yes. Okay. I assume that if that happens, like we'll know what wounds are by then. Yes. Some of the schemes in this game are incredibly creative, and then like the since this is the begin the um yeah. introductory set, they're just kind of like you gain a wound and gain three wounds, and then you lose. 
I can buy a Wolf of Reen, yeah, that's or I can idea. buy a Shield Officer. I'm going to buy the Shield Officer. Oh, okay. And that's it. All right. Oh, wait, can I do anything with two attack? No, nope. never mind. Yeah, All right. very, very Good rarely turn. will two attack. Yeah, help you out. All right. Got it. Master Strike! So wait, let's wait for um, Avery to get their hand back together. Oh, so we're all going to have to KO yes. someone? Yep, KO a hero from your hand. Okay. Alright. What's my turn going to look like? Probably this and this, so I could... That's a tough decision, actually, but I'm going to go with... You'll yeah, see, I have you. no decision to make. Let's go with you. <laughs> yeah. Do you just have six of the same card? <laughs> or five now? Yep. <laughs> Incredible. What's, yeah, what's, early the game button to, what's the button to look at a card? Uh, alt or... Ah, thank you. Yes. So... Oh, yeah, I've just been zooming in, I forgot. Yes. I have another one of... Uh, the color of this, so I'll go with the Iron Man here. Yes. Oh, yeah. So I can just explain superpowers, um, which are the icons. So, like that card, and then this Hawkeye have a like tech superpower, which means if you played another tech card this turn, uh, so the order of things matters. If you played another tech card earlier, then you get that effect. Otherwise, you don't get that effect. And some of them which have a team icon instead of the card type icon, so it works the same way. I can't believe I'm getting cut on Iron Man. All right, and that's it. All right. I'll let you draw your cards. Yes, and also I have just some because I'm pedantic. We'll, yeah, keep the discard on the right. <laughs> nice. But oh, well, so we should get rid of the master strike over here. Um, yeah, let's keep those over there. So keep them organized. Yes. Ah, it's Doctor Octopus. He's a Spider-Man villain. We know Doctor Octopus. I need to. A lot of Spider-Man fans may not know who Dr. Octopus is at this point. He's been in, like... I guess he was in the last Spider-Man film, but, like, it's well, been a while since he's been around. Spider Spider-Man 2 is still relevant, right? Like, that's still a movie that people talk about, even outside of, like... I think so. Movies. Is it? Yeah, that's, okay. that's, that's still, like, a thing, I think. I, right, am okay. I out of touch? Oh, why is it doing this when I... Oh, <laughs> All right, so I have two recruit and two, three, four attack... What can I fight? Let, I could fight Dr. Fight Octopus. It. Fight everybody. I like this fight effect. When you draw a new hand of cards at the end of the turn, draw eight cards instead of six. I get it. I get that joke. There is also... Oh, no. Okay, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Cute. Oh, See, I, I just read it and like my card advantage sensor dinged and I stopped paying attention. There is also Sewer Scroll and I would get, I would get the bystander from that. Um... Why does my alt key keep undoing that? I will have to look at that. I'm holding I'm holding alt right now, but it's not showing it. Like sometimes it's showing it, sometimes it's not. Okay, whatever. I will have to talk about that on their Discord. Um hmm. now I'll take Dr. Octopus. And I don't think I can buy anything with two. Oh, no, I could buy one of the Wolverines. I don't really have yellow though. Is the trouble? Uh, the yellow is called instinct. So yeah, the types of cards are instinct, ranged, tech, and covert is red. I don't know if you have any cards that are covert though in the, in this set of heroes. Ah, uh, one of the Spider Mans might. Be, I don't know. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I don't want to buy the Wolverine. Wolverine did the the, the wolf that the two cost Wolverines go really good with Spider Man though. Whatever it's worth. That makes sense. Yeah. Oh, six, and then I have to draw seven, and then so I have seven in my hand, but I ran out of deck, so I have to shuffle my deck first to draw the eighth card. Yeah. Alrighty. All right, and you're done. Yep. All right, let's take a look at the villain. Who are you? The endless armies of Hydra. Okay. And it is a villain, so it does. Yes. Mean. Yep. And if I were to fight it, play the top two cards of the villain deck because they're endless. Right. So if oh. I killed that then at the oh, beginning dead. of the next turn someone would escape so that's no good that's bad <laughs> yes yeah sometimes it's better not to fight the endless armies of Hydra. Yeah. yeah so 
I'm, I'm going to do a quick thing and make sure I don't screw anything up with my order. Alrighty. All right. I don't think it's going to matter. But I do have available to me one, two, three, four attack points. All right. I'll go and do the Spider-Man effect. So reveal the top card of your deck. Yes. If that card costs two or less, draw it. All right. Uh... We, we can't see okay. it until you let go. Oh, oh, sorry. Yep. Yes. So never draw it. Yep. Okay. Yep, so you have four attack. You could fight Super Scroll, or you could fight any of the three guys. I just need to decide if that changes anything for me. Yes. And so another yeah. thing to mention is, so when it says each, play, each player KOs one of their heroes, that includes cards you played, so you can play a card first and then KO it. So okay. you still get its, its, its uh, points and effect. Actually, now that I realize what I've drawn, I might change my... Yeah, let's do it. Let's have some fun, actually. I want to yeah? fight the. Okay, I thought you were gonna fight the Amazon wanna... of Hydra. <laughs> it's like, oh no, <laughs> not that kind of fun. I want to fight the Hammond. <laughs> All right, so yeah, just grab them and. So that's gonna give me one more recruit point, right? Yes. Yep. I will fix that in a second. Yeah. Because just... okay, th that means I have a total of four. Uh, four. I'd like to buy both of the Wolverines. All right. I mean, I guess I should technically have waited, but yep. it, it didn't matter. Yes. I'm going to put both of these into my discard pile. I'm yep. going to fix that. Discard everything I played and draw up to six and then my turn. Yes. Now, when, uh, you, oh, what? Hmm? when you gain a recruit point, it has to be used on that turn? Yes. Yep. Everything resets back to zero at the end of your turn. Mm-hmm. Already, Avery, or, yeah, Avery. Yep. Uh, we got a sentinel. That's not very exciting, but I do have to move. No, stuff no, no, down. no, no. Those ones don't move yet. Just, just, just the ones that have to. So this one. Oh, I. Yep. There's no. You know, there. it's a little bit busy with the art. A little. I definitely yeah. thought there was another card there. Yeah, a little bit. I think also the bystander's <laughs> not helping. Yeah. Yeah. You were, just, I... you were distracted by Among Us Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> That's on recording now. You're welcome. It's not That's Among right. Us. That's right. It's... There, it, look, it looks is. like Among Us. Look. It's not Among Us. It looks like Among oh. Us. It's just Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but he has the half of his face cut off, so the other half looks like the window thing into the suit. Uh, where are my cards? What? Look, in, in 10 years, Among Us is going to own Disney anyway. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but I can't... It's not showing me my... Uh, there's a card. There's a, like on the bottom of the screen, or yeah, I think it might be doesn't... just H. No, if there's a button, there's a command that doesn't. Um... Well, that's okay. We're doing this the hard way. Okay. Uh... So I have attack wise. Oh, nothing. I have one. So these Spider Men don't attack at all. Let's yes. See. What does yeah, he do? So, yes. So yeah, you, yeah, so... you should read it before you play. When you before you play it, so that you do the action first. Oh, that's why you were saying playing them can matter in certain. Yes. Okay. Yep. Um. Well. I'm just gonna at least do this this yep. one here. Oh, you have the whole deck. Yep. I should just be able to do. There we go. Yep. So yeah, I can take that, that card. Yep. And then you do another Spider-Man. What? So I cannot draw that. What? Wait, I can't no, see. We can't the, see it. What's? Let go. Let go of it so we can see it. Oh, I'm so sorry. There it's it's that one. So yes. I can't do that one. Yep. So you put it back on top of your deck. Yep. Okay. And then the second Spider-Man trigger is gonna be really exciting. Yeah, so the so the reason yeah, Spider Man is very heavy on twos because like if you have one thing that breaks your combo like that, then none of the other Spider Mans work. Six. So I have six purchasing power. What can I get for six? That's good. Probably a Cyclops. Are they the same? They're the same. I'm buying Cyclops. Alrighty. That's my turn. Right. <laughs> I'll fix it. It's fine. No. Take, I'll fix Another it. I'll signal. fix it. There. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Here, also, do, shake them. I was going to say, so grab, grab everything and shake them, and it should go together a bit. Oh, really? Yeah. Too late. So unless one of you is planning on having a big combat turn, we're going to have problems that real quick. That shuffles them. But yeah, okay. that's fun. Um, so we drew another Sentinel. Ba, ba, ba. Nope. Yeah, good enough. Right. So I do have four attack. Good. And I'll go for super scroll here. Everybody, so each player KOs one of their heroes. Everybody's okay with that right now? Sure. Yeah. 
it's going to be this. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's going to be this one. I don't need recruit points. Oh. We need to kill something. Yes. And once again, what did the bystander do for, again? I uh, just give you an extra victory point. Ah, okay. Yep. So you're winning, probably. And then I don't think also, has, there's has anything any... here I want to buy. Real quick, has Avery just uh, KO'd a card? What happened? Um, oh, yeah, so... let me do it. Let me do it. Yes. Let me do it. I, I just got to put mine into my discard pile instead of KOing it, oh. so I, did, I fixed that. Yes, good. Oh, I, I am... KO from my hand, correct? Yes. Okay. I should have paid attention. If, if I saw this here, I would have bought it first. Oh, well. Ah. Damn. Not interested in the Wolverine, so I'll just pass on buying anything. Alrighty. That's my turn. Cool beans. Yeah, see, they kind of grouped together, except the red one also I... came. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. There. No, you, okay, you have to, un you you have to unbox. Oh, yeah, so, like, click click away from it, so, like, unclick off of it, you... and then... No, because the problem yeah. is it's still in her box. Like, Oh, okay. I think, wait, it should it should be fine. Yes. Yeah. I thought, I thought maybe I could, like, take it out of... Nope. Like... No, wait, wait, you put those on top of your deck. Uh, wait, wasn't that my discard? Was it? Did you? Yeah, that your was what I had here. should be here. Yeah. And face up. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I think you still have those cards in your deck, right? It was right? five, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, boop, boop, boop. Yeah, because yeah, you put your whole thing or... in, but you had KO'd one. Yeah. Yes, okay, yep. Okay. No, I'm draw six, yep. We fixed it. We're all good. Yes, no worries. Oh no, it's Pybok, the power scroll. I don't know anything about this character, honestly. <laughs> I guess he's a scroll. I looked him up. He's like a leader of the scrolls. I, he was never in any comics I read, so I don't, I don't care. He's the leader of the scrolls. You know yes. him well. Yes, or like a king of the scrolls or whatever. <laughs> but I have one attack. I have two more attack. And then because I played another Avenger card this turn, I have three attacks. So three, four, five, six. Uh, I could take out some of those Sentinels. And I also have, I should get my recruit out. I have four recruits. Let's, yeah, I'll fight a sentinel. And then every, and I get to KO one of my heroes, which will be one of these guys. And I'll fight a sentinel. KO one of our heroes, which will be one of these guys. And then with my four recruit, um, hmm. Let's get another of the stupid Hawkeye. <laughs> All right. That is my turn. All right. Well, it's a real good thing you did that because I don't plan to be fighting anything. This oh, and then turn. we can put one back here. Yeah. Oh, right. Spider Man. Ooh, a oh, yeah. great responsibility, Spider Man. Yes. All right, uh, so, so yeah, don't you don't don't move him yet until you know it's a villain. But yeah. Oh, true. Yeah. It's, it's a villain. Also, what did you? <laughs> okay, I think. Wait, hang on. Yeah, there we go. It's a green goblin. And, oh, and if we fight it, everyone gets a bystander, which is exciting. Famous character of Macedon Fediverse, the Green Goblin. Green Goblin. <laughs> All right, so yes. Oh, and then so th read the read the yeah, termination. Yeah. Yep. To play this yeah, card. Yeah, I'm... Discard a card from your hand, so you can't play everything. Be a... Yeah, so it's gonna be the Shield Trooper that you discard, right? Yeah, it would be. Yes. Uh, and I do have a bunch of things that this Wolverine would proc off of, so. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I think I've done that correctly. I can take those. Yeah. Cool. So I'll put this into my discard pile along with my hand. Uh, draw to six in my turn. Yep. I only drew one. You can only have one. Yes. So now you shuffle oh, your deck and draw uh, five more. Uh, turn it over. Oh, come on. Yeah, just hit R. Uh, you have five more, and now I can end my turn. Yes. I'm going to grab a card. Hang on. Why is... Oh. Okay, one of Holly's cards is just glowing on my screen. Like, the hand, That's the card cool. in her hand is just glowing, and I can't make it That's stop. That's great. Okay, no worries. I'll just ignore <laughs> it. Yep. Oops, I drew two. Hold on. Oh. There we go. I didn't realize you could do that. Ninjas. All right. So we got to move some stuff. Oh, you got it. Yep. Okay. Huh. I'm, not, I'm about to have a really bad turn in a minute. see if I can fix that. Um... I mean, I'm not about to have a good turn either. No, I can I do see that in here or whatever. I wish. Why can't I 
grab everything from my hand. And where did my yeah, hand go? Yeah, you can't draw a box around it for some reason. And yeah, if you go in the settings, there's one of the, one of the buttons says to do it. So just read everything in there when you're when it's not your turn. You try to find it, I guess, because I couldn't find it. <laughs> All right, I'll look for it. Let me just toss everything over here. Just a little, little, little more gently, please. <laughs> no, I was having fun with that. Uh, uh like Gambit throwing cards. Not Gam Gambit game. is another character in in the base set. I'm gonna grab Wolverine. All right. And that's like, unless there's a two. No, there's not a two. Okay, that's there's it. A, there's a two. No, 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 a two. Uh, what do you call? It? Fight. Oh, two fight. Two no, no, there's no two fight. I only, I only have four purchasing power, so All that's right. it. I should have gone for Spider Man's. Should have, should have kept, Man. kept you guys from having them. Oops. No, I want the whole stack, please. Thank you. There it is. I should probably KO my Spider Man at some point because I don't have a lot of things to cost two. Yeah, least. probably. And also, the the city is very full now. All right. Right. Then. All right. Good luck. Oh Ooh, no! Bad luck. So Sentinel escapes, and everyone moves forward. So I I want to double check to make sure I remember how the escape working. So let me pull that up real quick here. Come on, load. There we go. And then the next villainous one that we can't really afford to fight, and the next one after that has eight health. All right. So when a villain escapes, um, the player who it is KOs a hero a, a hero from the HQ that costs six or less. So it should look at the HQ, look at the characters, and decide which one you don't really want and KO it, or which one yeah you don't think people will want. So we're okay with second Spider-Man? Yes. Up to you. That's just for variety's sake. Yeah, sure. I mean, it, doesn't, right. it doesn't seem like anyone's going hard on Spider-Man, so I would put him in a different pile. That's just how I organize yeah. things. Yeah, okay. Like keep gray heroes in one pile, and yeah. And immediately replenish? Yep. Yeah, we're going to replace it, yeah. So then our hero deck is finite, then? Yes. Okay, and so, so another way um, evil can win is if the villain deck runs out or if the hero deck runs out. The, the e game can know you out. I'm gonna fish for a card first, see what I get. Yay, Spider-Man! Uh, this also says rescue a bystander first, so just take a bystander from the stack and put it in your pile. Oh, okay. I thought that was only if it was active. Nope. Um, yeah. Rescue bystander means grab one of the bystanders here. Yep. That seems really good, actually. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't. Okay. The thing is, it doesn't do anything else. It doesn't give you any attack or recruit. Oh, that's true. I didn't yes. even look at the stats. So yeah. my next, my ne my next card costs three, so nothing there. Uh. I only have two attack, nothing there, and then I have a choice here. I don't have a lot of discard synergy, so I'll go with the Wolverine here. Alrighty. And that's my turn. Alrighty, my turn. Another villain's going to escape, probably. Yep. Yep. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, well, since it seems like no one's going for Spider-Man, I'm going to get rid of the Spider-Man. And now we're, we're full of Cyclopses. Oh, my hand went away too, so I must have hit the button that makes hand goes, hands go away. Did you I, ever figure out what I'm it was? C. C? That's, it is that's C. It. Okay. I just found it. That's why it's so easy to hit. Yeah. Ooh, what do you know? There it is. Uh, it's 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 a button you press so that you can see and not see your hand. I'm trying to oh. crouch. I'm using C to crouch under the table. <laughs> All right, so I, I have bad news. I only have two attack. That is bad news. Yeah. That's okay. I'll I'll just draw. Uh. Um. I don't know. I'll just draw hmm. a scheme twist. It'll be chill. I think I'm gonna go with uh, optic blast here. Get more get more attack in my deck. Alrighty. Ollie's turn. Alrighty, let's see what we have from the villain's deck. Ooh, bad. <laughs> oh, it's scroll shapeshifters. They're cool. So then you yep. escape. Oh, oh, I. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. Oh, goddamn it. All I right. still have it selected. So scroll shapeshifters uh, are interesting. Read what, read what the card says. So. Ambush, which well now I can't read it because people it's Chris's oh. run. Hold <laughs> alt, hold alt. Yeah, I'm doing it now. I'm doing it now. Yeah. 
uh, ambush, put the rightmost hero from the HQ under this villain. Uh, this villain's power is equal to that hero's cost. So is yep. that when it arrives yeah, oh, okay. in the yes. city? Yep, so the easy way to do that is just do this, and yeah. you know, hold control so that it doesn't do that, and then... Boop. So now if we fight Squirrel Shapers, you have to take that covering fire. <laughs> Hawkeye card. Yep. Okay, and its power is... Or it's... Yep, its attack it's is five. Fight stat is five. Which yeah, is attack. Scary. Yeah. And you get the card after beating him. Yep. Hey. Uh, so if you were hoping that I would uh, stop a villain, I have bad news. Uh, well, don't worry. I should have some good attack on my turn. In fact, mm, I might have such good attack that I might just want to fight the Mastermind instead, but I don't know. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to play my... Cyclops which means I have to discard something, and I don't have enough power to fight anything, so I'm going to discard my Wolverine. Alrighty. And then I have all of these. So I have seven total recruit points to my name. That's that's not bad. So I would. I oh, don't wait. Hey, they don't search in there, Avery. What? That's cheating. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. That's cheating. Don't do that. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about that's it. That's cheating. I didn't get that far. Okay, good. <laughs> No cheating, though. I could take the I think this big Cyclops. And yeah, I think that's yeah, a good choice. I think I, yeah, take that, try and get good like discard synergies going. Yeah. And also not just load up my deck with tiny things that will never help me. Yep. What have we got here? I think it's a good card. I mean, this Cyclops is good in general because it's still four attack, even if you don't get to use the discard effect of it. Yeah. But you do have some Cyclopses, which will, yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I have one, I think, but I can try yeah. and get more. Yeah. So that'll be my turn. I'll draw back up to six. Yep. Oh, well, uh, I just say, sorry, I just really forgot to do something. Green Goblin says ambush. Green Goblin captures a bystander. <laughs> so let's just give him bystander. Oh. It's all Oops. good. Okay. Oh. Yeah, there we oh. go. Yeah, good enough. I'm, trying to, help. I'm, make, I'm trying to help him making things worse. Yeah, no, you're good. Let's put it on top of him because it doesn't matter. Yep. Alrighty. Hey, guess what? It's, it's our a, guy. I, I can't see it. You have to drop it first. Oh, it's another Green Goblin. <laughs> okay, another Green Goblin. All right, well, the bystander escapes and Green Goblin escapes. So, and yeah, let's give him a bystander first. Yeah. So yeah. you said it was worse if the bystander is yes escaped with, right? Yes. So sorry. Um. So there's a thing. Um. It's trying to snap to the snap point, but if you hold control, then it won't snap to the snap point. That way. Yeah. So we put him up here, and then. Oop. Yes, I'm pretty sure it's you have to. We all have to discard a card. I think that's all it is. Um. Let me see. Yes, yeah, since the given villain has any captured bystanders, and each player must discard a card from their hand as a penalty for failing to rescue the bystanders. Oh, that seems fine. So I'm I'll going to discard this recruit. And Before that's in addition the... to KO. Yes. Mm. Yeah. Not not KO. Just discard. Oh, okay. Yes. But everyone. Play... Everyone. Everyone has to. Yep. So did you discard a card already? Well, yes. um, before before I do, before I decide who to, yeah. um, am I am I allowed to play a card that has? and attack and just like not attack anybody with it just play it for its effect yes okay yep so yeah so the attack value just adds it to your pool of attack that you have for this turn okay yes you know i said that and then i changed my mind about what i was going to do anyway so <laughs> but at least now i know no there we go okay i've got five plus so i have six purchasing power all right uh there's nothing for six but i can buy two threes Let's do. Yeah. What is that symbol? Oh, if it's another like tech guy. Yes, it's a yeah. If you yeah, have played another tech up, card this turn, then you get up that in the effect. corner. Yep. Oh, to play this card, you must discard a card from your hand. Uh, I wanted you damage, so I'm gonna buy this one and this one. We're going. Oh, it ended up in my hand on accident because I did it too far. But I bought a Wolverine and a Cyclops. Beans. And that's it. Black. Start drawing cards. That's your turn. Yep. That's it. I will say the good thing about the scenario is that a villain's escaping does not really hurt us. Oh wait, <laughs> wait, wait, we forgot to do something. Um uh when the oh. villain escaped, yeah. Um Avery needed to KO a cure from the HQ. So which ones I think you bought these two, right? In these I slots. The... Yeah, yeah, but in these slots, so yeah, choose one of these ones to KO. Yeah. 
Uh, get out of here, Cyclops. All right, oh. put him up. Put him up here. I didn't. It's, it's too late. Yeah, that's just what happened. Yes, and so now this one <laughs> escapes. Another red ninja. So then I got to do the same. Yep. Oh, I can do damage this next turn. Yes. Also, for what it's worth, the hand ninjas, if you've never heard of them, um, you know how in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, there's, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, there's the Foot yeah. Clan? <laughs> is that what this is uh, parodying? No, the Foot or, Clan or is the a other, parody the of the, nin uh, the hand ninjas. Right, right. the other way around. <laughs> other way, yeah. So anyone losing sleep over Spider-Man? Nah, it doesn't seem like it's going for him, unfortunately. No. Spider-Man is very good, but if you we'll just, if you we'll go with Spider-Man, Spider you, you have to go only Spider-Man, or only twos, basically. I got five. That's just enough for Hawkeye here. I think that's a good idea. Alrighty. And one attack, not doing anything. Oh, that's a shame. That's my turn. Oh no, it's Scroll Queen Varenki. I know about as much about her as I know about Pybok. I guess she's just a queen of scrolls and she's bad. Yeah. All of the art in this from like Spider -Man. the comics? Um, I think some of it might be original art for the game. I'm not gotcha. sure. Yeah. All right. So let's do this. I got well, one there's, attack. There's an ambush, there's an ambush oh, there's an ambush effect. I'm sorry. Yes. Thing. Yep. Same thing as the other one. Put. Uh, why was it not? That's right. the highest cost. Highest cost hero, uh, which is. They're all the same. They're all the same. So I get to choose one. Um. Hmm. Well, I'm not going to be... Well, I could fight something. So let's see which one do I actually want. Mm -hmm. That quick draw is very good, actually. I'll still go with that. Alrighty, so I have one attack. Two, three attack. Four, five, six attack. Seven, eight, nine attack. And one recruit. You fight the mastermind. No, I should fight some of these villains to get them out of the city. Nah, who cares? Let's wreck the city. Fight the mastermind. I can do n nine attacks. So. <laughs> yeah. Um, and, I no, that's an idea. I'm going to do this. So now I have two recruit. Three recruit. And I'll also gain this one. So that's my nine attack. Fair and nice. with my three recruit, um, who do I want? Uh, maybe that uh, Iron Man Endless Invention. That's very good because I have a few tech cards. Yeah. I'm starting to build a deck here. And clear some stuff out of the city, which is nice. Yep. Oh, and then, yeah, there we go. Here's an interesting thing to point out. Um, so you have, see how some of the cards have borders on. Well, the cards have borders on them. Mm -hmm. The cards that have a border on both sides are the the common cards. So there are five of, five of each of those. Uh, there are some cards that only have a half border. Those are uncommon. So there's only three of those. And then cards like this one are the rare. There's only one of them in the deck. Okay. Yes, but otherwise the doesn't mean doesn't mean anything else. All right. So you've taken your turn, and that we reveal it. Yes. Yep. Sentinels. All right, and we can fight it and KO one of our heroes. Yep. Well, just just whoever fights it does. Well, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to play my Spider-Man and Spider look at the top card. It oh. does not cost. Uh, but that's that's okay because I'm going to draw it anyway, and then the next one. Okay. Good. That works. <laughs> One. Oh yeah, you, god. You can just you can also just push one on the deck to draw one card. So that's a total of three fight. Could I do better than Oh god. All these cursors flickering on my there it goes. All right. I don't think I'm going to do anything too fancy. I'm just going to uh, one, two, three, four, five fight total. And I would like to. Uh, that would be six. Two, three. Yeah, six. Sorry, that is six. That yep. is, that's what I meant. I like to fight here and get the bystander. Awesome. And then I have stuff I can't do anything with, so. Okay. 
I get these into my here, these go into my discard. I draw back up to six, which is come on, pick it up, pick up the whole thing. Just hold, hold, click, hold, click, hold, click. There you go. I'm too, I'm too impatient. Yeah. Okay. All here's right, an, here's now, another useful trick I want to teach you: is if you want to. Oh well, go ahead. Oh. Go ahead, Avery. Yep. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. Yes. Viper. She is uh, the Madam Hydra, and she's like an important Hydra person. That's all I really know. She's apparently not right. even. She's the first character in the comics who has the title Madam Hydra, but like apparently the name Madam Hydra goes back, and there are just tons of Madam Hydras that no one knows the identity of. Like that's just the lore of it, but. Yeah, she's the only one who appears in comics and is named Madam Hydra. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna before I do anything else, we'll see if that's a two or less. It's not. It goes back on top. What was it? I don't get just like now. It was a Wolverine. Uh, Lego. Oh, I'm sorry. I got Lego. Yes. Wolf yep. Wolverine. Healing factor. Cool. Uh, so then we'll just. I'm just gonna leave him over here. Uh, 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 the oops. theme is cool. Uh, What's that? Uh, cool, that's all. Yes, I like it a lot. I have six attack and four. Two for purchasing. Yes. For six attack, what's the best bang for my buck here? You could get I could do this. Yeah, you could you could get the soccer eye. Or you could fight uh Viper. Okay, well now hang a second. Hang on yeah. a second. I get the benefit of both the when I play a card that has both purchase value and fight value i get both of those benefits yep or do you not okay i i was like confused for a second I'm like wait do i only get to choose one or the other but i get to do both yep which card are you talking about well like the cyclops card there has fight and in... oh not that one never mind I'm none confused. of them do yeah never mind some cards all will right. but i don't i don't even know if any of them do in in this group of cards yeah but... all right well i'm gonna fight somebody i should probably fight the scroll because he's closest to the eh, it doesn't make a difference because like they only go forward when something pushes them forward so. but i, well, I would go I'm with gonna... what you want to fight i'm fighting the scroll so Alrighty. i take this now what yep. happened i gain the hero underneath and yep. that's it yep so where does he go where's the in discard your, pile for in the... your victory pile which is over here oh i see i see i see okay so the... nope. I'll, come, I'll, I'll fix it i'll fix it i got it and that goes in I'll your discard it, I'll fix it. that'll be discard in a second um and then I'm going to buy something for four, which is just going to be Mr. Cyclops. Alrighty. Uh, Mr. Cyclops, shoot me a beam. I don't know what you've it. ever seen. Yeah. And then I go this. You can also just hit I uh, G, I think. No, um, is it... no it's a different I like button. I, I, like cha I changed it to G to gather cards, but it's a different button that gathers cards. But, I'm yeah. really into this shaking the cards to shuffle them things. So sure. I'm doing that now. <laughs> Oops, nope. Nope. And ninjas. I was. I thought that was. I was trying to push the talk. Sorry. Oh. Okay. Say. Okay. See what this draws. That explains why you're so quiet. Because you have to push a button to talk. <laughs> I can't imagine having to push a button uh, to nope. talk. Back in the day, that's how you had to do it. Right. Yeah. I know. But now we just talk, 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 talk. That's all I do. Yep. Uh, hmm. Okay, so I will have five attack thanks to this plus one. Question yes. is how badly everybody's going to get hurt by this card's effect here, Viper. Um, Probably not very. Uh, let's see here. Because I have the kidnapper in mind. Oh, I don't, have one, I don't have one actually. Wow. Okay. Yeah. I don't. I, we, wounds are not that bad though. They're a little bad. If you want to read what a wound does, it's up here. Um, it basically just fills up your deck with junk, and if you you can also just use the ability on it to if you don't recruit any heroes or defeat any villains on your turn, you may KO all the wounds from your hand. So you're basically passing a turn. Yes. To get rid of them. Yep. And. I noticed that the Wolverine cards, a lot of them heal wounds, yes. too. Yes. Weird, because it's almost like that's his ability. <laughs> and also, um, in one of the other cards in the base set is Hulk. Hulk gets stronger from wounds. Oh, that's cool. Yes. 
And then I'm just going to toss these out here, I like too. Hulk. Um, Hulk, is, Hulk is one of my favorite Marvel characters. <laughs> so we're okay with dealing with wounds if I just get the highest attack off here? It's up to you. It. Yeah. I'll live. Do it. Okay. And then with three... So everyone else takes a wound and puts it in your discard pile. Oh, I'll put it in my hand. <laughs> Come on. Uh, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. It's still there, a good there. attack. <laughs> I'll take an Iron Man, sure. Oh, it's really fun to shake things. I'm enjoying this. Okay. <laughs> All right, it's, it's setting all. Satisfying. All right, so I was conflicted on whether I would um, try to clear up the city or not this turn, but no, I'm definitely going to uh, fight the mastermind this turn. So first, yeah. I have to discard a card for that. Hell yeah! And then three, four, five, six, seven, and one more recruit that I can't do anything with. So how the fighting the mastermind works is that's why there's a deck under him that is shuffled, and I take the take the top card and do it. Fight. Look at the top. Why was he doing that? Look at the top three cards of your deck. KO one, discard one, and put one back on top of your deck. Okay. That's kind of nice. Yes. Uh, well, KO this one. Um, uh, what is it? Discard one and put one back. Uh, let's see. I will. Yes, discard this one and put this one back. You don't get to know which one I put back. It's a secret. Only the viewers know. And then that goes in my victory pile. And then Red Skull can go back on top of his deck. And that is my turn. Success. Yes. All right. Let's see what comes from the villain deck. A bystander. Yes. Uh, oh, hold control. There we yes, go. excellent. That's not lined up enough. I'm very pedantic about it there we go all right so i can do one two three four just picturing like a set so sentinels are like big giant robots that hate x-men um so i'm just picturing like the giant robot like holding the bystander in its hand but still trying to fight i don't know very king kong uh does this work the way that i i think it does okay I'm going to play my Determination Cyclops. And as an additional cost, I have to discard a card from my hand. And let me I'm guess. Gonna discard, yes. I'm going to discard this one so yep. I can return it to my hand. Yes, yes. <laughs> Excellent. That is, that is how Cyclops do. Then I'm going to play the Cyclops. And I'm I'm just gonna put. Oh, sorry, Excellent. my phone's making noise. No worries. So now in like my pool floating, I guess I have four and six. Four and six. Yeah. yeah. So I would like to. What happens if I'm asked to KO something from my hand, but I don't have anything in my hand? Uh, KO my heroes, so yeah, KO, you, KO your heroes includes heroes you played this turn. So you still get the recruit oh, from okay. them, but okay. you get to KO them. Yep. Okay, so I could use my six to like kill both of yep. these. Totally. Yep. Which I think I would like to do. Awesome. So then those are all of my six fight points, and I've gained a recruit. Hold, hold, from... the, hold it down. Yeah, I've ga I've gained a. Well, I'm trying to yeah. move it over to get the yes. point that I gained a recruit off of that one. So we can just do this to show that you have it there. You have six recruit yeah. there. Um, okay. I, to... I was zoomed in too far. I couldn't move all the way over. So I mean, I you can also use Wazi to move. So, like, I zoomed in pretty oh, far, and I just like true. yeah. Uh, I, have to, I have to KO something. I'm going to KO yep. this. That makes sense. Yeah. So now I have six total recruit points, and I want to buy all of these. But I'll do it strategically. Yeah. I'm going to buy this one. Ooh. Ooh, big Cyclops. Then, then I'm going to buy this one. <laughs> uh, okay, and I can't afford that one anyway, so buy that one. Nice. I like this Cyclops because it has nothing to do with Cyclops' theme of discarding cards. It's just that his other theme of being leader of the X-Men. Yeah. These all go into my discard pile. I draw up to six, and I end my turn. Cool beans. 
Let's draw a villain. It's ninjas. Yay. Ninjas go to sewers where they belong. Yep. And then I'm going to do a thing. I'm going to play Wolvermarine. And I'm going to get rid of this wound card nice. from my... Uh, where does this go? Uh, in the KO pile, it's just over here, yep. Okay. Yeah. But I get to draw a card. Yeah. That didn't flip the card when I did it that way. Flip. Alright, uh... So I have... Two... Four... Seven... You have to discard a card. For that one. Eight. I will happily discard one of these guys. And I also have two purchasing power that I'm not going to use, because I'm going to attack, I think, the big guy. Nice. The big man. Yep. So just take the uh, top card off and draw the next card under him. Oops. Yeah, don't no, just, yeah, just, yeah, just put him over there. And reveal it. Uh, you get three... Three attack. So you can attack. attack some more if you want. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh, and I have enough to attack a four then, I think, because I had eight right now. Uh. I got uh, Kareem turn turn my head five, over. Six, seven, eight. Yeah. Yeah. But there are no fours. There's there are threes. Well, I can attack a three though. Yeah. That's fine. <laughs> Could you take... use all of your attack? You know, all of your attack to attack the mastermind now? Um, I wouldn't have enough. Yeah. He he only has four left. I'd be oh, sure. Okay. I, 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 I yeah. did my math wrong. Never mind. Yes. yes. Not quite. Not quite. Uh, I'm gonna do. You this. could. I, I was gonna I say if you could find the hand and just see, then you have three recruits. So you could recruit something if you want. Like that Wolverine. But no, I'll take this because I can KO? KO something. Sure. And I can KO that other guy and get, clean my deck out. Yeah, sure. Got to you. Got to keep the deck tidy. Yep. Uh, yeah. So I'm gonna get rid of don't, this chump. Don't cut me on cool Wolverine cards. That chump is gone. I'm gonna grab all these guys. Come here. Oh, you. Yeah, he should go in there. There, and I'll draw back up. It's very funny because, like, in later sets, all of the fight effects of the masterminds are like very rude and damaging you, and in this one, it's like, hey, you get three attack. <laughs> <laughs> It, a lot of people say that the masterminds in the core set are more pinatas. <laughs> All right, I've got cards. So and, by, wait. Yep, I see. A bystander from there. Okay. Yep. So put it under there. Hold control when you. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Nice. Oh no, that's it. You don't need to draw another one. Oops. Since I didn't see it, we'll just pretend no one saw it. <laughs> don't worry about it. I didn't see it. Yep. Right. I was Why under I... my desk because I dropped something, so I didn't see it either. Oh, well, I wouldn't have shown on the screen anyway. But yeah. How was your desk adventure? Oh, I, I oh, forgot to drop to. Pay my... I forgot to draw cards at the end of my turn. All right. So order here doesn't matter. I have six, but I can only attack this, so I will. Alrighty. And oh, I should have. Oh, I, I could pull it back out, but that. Um, the effect gave me one extra recruit, so now yep. I have four, which I don't it's think mattered time. anyways. Yes. Uh, well, I had I took another one of these already, so I'll take. Yeah, I have more synergy with the Iron Man. Alrighty. Ooh, I have a good, very good hand this turn. I just I. <laughs> Can I drew but let's play a villain first. It's a scheme twist. Nothing happens. Twist number two. I will not stay loaded up. It's okay, that there it goes. Okay. Oh. But it doesn't matter. I was looking at the things I didn't realize. We've cleared the city. It's safe. Yeah, city is safe. So I get to fight right. I'm probably gonna fight the mastermind if I, I think I have enough. So first I play this and I get to draw a card. And then I play this, and so I played an Avengers previously, that's worth three, so I have four, five, six, seven. This lets me draw two cards, because I played a tech this turn. Oh boy. Um, oh god, this is too good of a... Okay. <laughs> um, so then I have three, but I have to discard a card, which will be this recruit man. And this, this, and another three. So what do I have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, I'm gonna Yo, fight. I'm gonna, I'm gonna end the game. <laughs> do it. Oh, okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's fight. Draw two cards. Then draw another card for each Hydra villain in your victory pile. Um. I mean, it doesn't matter. I don't. I, whatever. That's yeah. good enough. <laughs> and then this fight, I get four recruit, and that's the end of the game. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hell yeah. 
So we won, yes. and now we can have our victory point. Yes, for you? correct. It's just number of cards. Uh, no, they have so there's a little red number nah. on each of them that um, is how many oh. points it's worth. Yes. So buy so, things are one each. Yeah, so I usually make like basically piles of, of some even number. Yes, that's oh, ten. Yeah, I, I guess I can do it publicly instead of in my stack explorer. Yeah. They don't show up in the. Uh, are they in the regular deck? Just do some of the regular. No, not generally. It's all in the the, the ones you. Yeah, the loot cards. The, only yeah. the villains okay. you fight. Yep. That's what I thought. Ten, uh, one, ten. Two, three, four. Mine's very easy. <laughs> So I have. Well, rip Hugo Weaving. We got him. One, two, three, four. I have nine total. Ten here. I think I have, I have eight. Yes. Oh. Yes, I'm trying to make sure I have this right. I did this right. Yeah, one, two, three. Yep. I have. Wait. Yes, I have 15. Congratulations. That's it. <laughs> Yay. Yay. That was Marvel Legendary. I like this game. And, yeah. like,. More expansions like cool. make it make it harder and make it more interesting. There's a lot of really weird stuff in it, so yeah, I would like to play more of this. Yeah, it's cool. Yes, I feel like I would try and lean more heavily into one archetype next time instead of six of them. Yeah. So like the thing is, the thing that's interesting though is like sometimes like there are, there are unexpected combinations where like like Iron Man works from tech, so he really worked well with my Hawkeye cards, yeah. and also he's he's yeah. Avengers, so that worked that helped my Hawkeye cards as well. I did I did think it was cool having a bunch of the two cost Wolverines that activate off of the um, Spider Man. The Spider Man. Yes, and they also they also draw cards, which also Spider Man does. So yeah, and actually they they work really well together because like let's say you have some cards that aren't two cost, then like the Wolverine card lets you draw any card, can help you get rid of those cards, and then mm -hmm. Spider Man can start working again. Also, really fun stuff like that. So yeah, I've got I've got two Cyclops cards here where one will let me discard it, and then one is if you discard it, you just put it right back in your hand, which yeah. is like yeah, Holly had that one. Very that was very good. Very good. All right, I'm gonna pull up our little schedule thing here so people can know what I'm streaming. To join me tomorrow. I'm gonna play more Sonic Origins. I'm gonna start into the Sonic Three half of uh, Sonic and Knuckles, and more Pokemon X. Oh, and I forgot the change of this, so I, I actually know what we're screaming Sh screaming next week. Next, not next week, two weeks from now. Yeah, let me update this real quick. Uh, boop, 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 boop. This one. So yeah. Oh, I didn't. I need to fix that image, I think. But um, yeah, two weeks from now, we're gonna play a card game called Love Letter, which is a interesting little deduction game. Um, where we're trying to get our love letter to a princess. So that's very fun. We will uh try that out. So yeah, thanks for joining me, everyone. You have a great night. All right, you too. Thanks for playing. Thanks for having us. Yeah. Take care. Take care.